Okay, I want to talk today about something called closing triangles. This is a concept from social networking, and it's really simple. Imagine that I am A, and I know two people, B and C. So I know B and I know C, but B and C don't know each other. When I introduce them to each other, I close a triangle. I think about it as... Let's say you have a gathering, you're inviting a bunch of people together, and you know all them, but they don't know each other. This is uh, pretty common when you have a party or you have a gathering, and you want to bring people together, and at the beginning of the event, let's say, you know them, you're the one common link between them all, and yet, uh, they don't know each other, at least not yet. So you bring them together, and this is what I'm trying to do with the campfire call. And at the beginning of the event, the social network looks something like this. But if you focus on closing triangles, then what's going to happen? People are going to meet each other. They're connecting. They're getting to know each other. And these triangles are closing. And, you know, I like to put people together and to break out groups, random collisions of people that may or may not know each other, but who might benefit from getting to know each other. And what's happening in all this closing triangles is you're creating a, a different kind of social network. You're the broker. You're the person who knows everybody who's creating introductions, creating opportunities for people to meet each other. And over the course of, if you have a successful event, successful networking, let's say, by the end of it, you've got something like this. These people have all become connected. They've got to know each other. They Maybe they are learning new things from each other. They're exploring possibilities. They're finding common ground. They're figuring out what they have in common. And then let's say each one of these people also has a social network. They have a group of people that they know. And they maybe they say, hey, you know what, maybe you ought to come to this campfire call. You might find that you make some interesting connections. And every time that they invite new people, we're creating new networks, new connections. So you may have your own community your own set of connections. But the more that you can, one of the things that is valuable, if you have a, a network of people that you value, people that you're, you find are interesting, good to know, interesting people, interesting connections, you're gonna start creating and discovering what you have in common. This idea of closing triangles, some people will see their network and say, you know what, I'm sitting here and I like this feeling of control, of being the spider at the center of the web, and yeah, you need to meet so, and they want to extract value out of that. They're going to introduce you, but it's a favor. You owe me a favor now. And so there are people who will sit at their kind of the center of their web and be a hub. And there is definitely power that comes from being at the center of a social network because this person can only meet that other person if you're going to broker that connection, if you're going to be a connector. And some people who will, call, will talk about themselves as connectors do this. This is a very ungenerous way to think about your social network. It, and it shows to me, this demonstrates that you don't have a lot of confidence in your own value in that network, that if the only value that you have to B and C is your ability to connect them, then you're extracting that power, you're running a toll booth. But I like to think of this as a way to think about your social network and think about the value that you can create. Can you close triangles? So next time you bring people together, next time you think about whether you're having a party or hosting a gathering, think about it in terms of closing triangles. Think about how, what are the triangles that you might close? Who might benefit from meeting who? 
what might the value be in one person connecting with another. And you don't even have to know. You can simply open up a, a call and let people close those triangles for themselves. That's what a gathering is all about. And a successful gathering is one in which at the end of it, at the beginning of it, you may be the only connection between all these people, but by the end of it, there are more connections between these other people than uh, they have with you. So give it a try.